Evening all. Um, I'm a minute early or two, so I'm going to wait and get my phone and everything set up while we're waiting for people to jump on board. <clears throat> Are we having a nice day or have we had a nice day? I do hope so. Right, let me have a look. I just need to find you on my phone so that I can read your comments as I go. Oh, hang on, there we go. There's me talking. Ugh. Hi, Steph. Hello, Mother. And hello, Diane. Right, okay. <clears throat> so, in theory, I have everything set up to work. Okay. Jane! Hello, lovely. <clears throat> right. Okay, so after the show last week, um, I've had quite a few of you, you may have seen on the Facebook group and um, on the page as well, lots of people asking about the technique I did in the very last uh, few minutes of the show I did with Catherine. And this was the, I want to say, 11 o'clock show last Wednesday on her channel. You can still catch it on Rewind. I'm going to try and get a copy of it and put it onto our YouTube channel and thereby onto Facebook. Hello Cheryl! Um, so that you can catch up with all the other distress techniques that I did in that show because I really did pack in as many as I can. However, we were down to the last couple of minutes when I showed you the alcohol ink cardstock with the distress clays and the oxides. Um, so I've had quite a few people ask me if I can redo that um so you guys can see it um it a much more i'm not going to use the word refined pace because i just don't think the word refined and me should ever be in the same sentence um but and you know what i mean just a little bit more um yeah so you can watch what i'm doing a little bit more okay so <clears throat> this is alcohol ink card stock and um, we only stock it in the minute in the four and a quarter and five and a half sheets uh five and a half sheets so sort of like postcard size um but we are going to be having it in bigger sheets as well um when we can because this is just such a fun technique okay so i'm going to be using the distress oxides i've got a few colors out um i'm also going to be using oh you can see how much i use it because it's mucky i'm going to be using the tim holtz distress glaze as well uh, the micro glaze um they've when we've been reordering this it either comes with a gray label or a brown label um but they're both exactly the same um they've just changed the labels and i'm assuming some of them are new and some of them are old but when we thought they changed it we then got stock of the other ones so <clears throat> you know there you are but if you so if you have the the distress micro glaze and it's got sort of like the silvery grey label, um, it's exactly the same thing. Okay, so you should be fine as long as it says Tim Holtz distress micro glaze. That's what it is. Okay, I'll be using my misters and distress sprayer, um, as well, and my heat gun. Um, my my nice quiet white heat gun still buried in the bottom of my tote, so I've got a loud my loud one. Um, so I won't be able to talk while I'm drying. I'm sorry. Um, didn't really think that one through, but it should be okay. <clears throat> okay, so this is alcohol ink cardstock. I've just got to try and wait because my phone, it doesn't seem to be going as fast as I am. There seems to be a little bit of a delay. Um, so I'm trying to watch. Hello, everybody. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, so we're doing the alcohol ink cardstock. So I'm hoping you can see. Right, so the alcohol ink cardstock. Um, and hopefully mum and Sam will be on to, to add any links or answer any other questions that I might miss. Um, so the alcohol in car stock is sort of sheeny, okay? It's got a really good <clears throat> sort of gloss to it. Now it's not the same as photo paper. Um, some people have had some success with photo paper. I'm not, you know, just trying to vlog you the alcohol in car stock. But it can be really hit and miss, dependent on the brand um it, it just depends on what the the cards coated with so so for this one i mean we do the 20 sheets it's 20 of the postcard sheets for a fiver so it's not like ridiculous money anyway but you can see it's really shiny like photo paper okay um so like i said sam will put you some legal so that's just like regular white card stock 
super smooth that I use. Um, and I'm going to be doing both of these because I want because the Distress Glaze isn't just for use on the alcoholic cardstock. It just gives you a, an effect that I want to show you. Okay. So let me put my other alcoholic cardstock back in the packet because you know what I'm like, and it will just get super grubby so if you've just tuned in um we do the four and a quarter and five and a half sheets at the minute but we will be getting the bigger ones in um but in all honesty it was a technique i wanted to play with and see if i liked before i bother getting tons of it 